Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and today I have a collective haul. I'm going to start off with Hobby Lobby. I went to Hobby Lobby and Dollar General and Dollar Tree, but very few items. So I went to Hobby Lobby because I've been on the hunt, not on the hunt, but I've been wanting one of these three tier trays and um, I finally picked one up. They had all their like metal and home decor 50% off. So this was regular $29.99. And they had, of course, different designs, colors. I wanted all black because obviously that's what I go with with my home decor here. I do plan on keeping it in the middle of my dining room table just so I can decorate it. I'm not sure if it's something I'm going to decorate or keep up all year round or just use it for the holidays but I'm super excited because couldn't wait because I cannot wait to decorate this especially for Halloween and all the holidays and stuff coming up so I did come across some clearance finds not that many as I was hoping for but I found these these are just like um, they're called dress it up they're like little um, flat back little accessories and I don't have anything like this especially for St. Patty's so I figured for 74 cents I would just grab one of those and then I also picked up some of these bling flat back rhinestones again 74 cents I got some gold ones I thought these were really pretty they're just a cute little girly themed sticker has the blow dryer the fancy slippers lipsticks and all that for 57 cents so i thought that was a nice deal i picked up these for 49 cents it's halloween stickers and then these were a dollar 24 and they're just like little wooden um stickers but i think these are so cute especially for embellishments so going along with Dollar Tree, um, I found these, they're like puzzles, and this is a 300 piece, and I saw a cheap Crafty Girl haul these, and I thought they were adorable. I just think this would look really cute framed. Um, I have not put a puzzle together for a very long time, but it's a pretty good size. It's 11 by 14, so... I just thought it would be cool to see how it looked um, framed up, maybe put in my craft room. I just think the whole picture is pretty neat. And then I just picked up two tees. These are um, green, of course, and they are in the kid size. I think they're by the Gildan brand, and they're the 5T. I picked up two of them because I want to try to do some football shirts for my nieces. I figured I could practice with my... Um, machine do some shirts and if i do a bad job at least it would be you know trying them up trying them on on little dollar tree t-shirts instead of adult t-shirts because i didn't find any in our size but i figured um, i can practice on the little tees and then a couple items from dollar general so um i saw bianca she has a youtube channel i will leave her link down below as well and she did a cute Dollar General haul. And these are just like little door pillows. And I'm into the trucks and all that. This is the only style that they had besides, I think, another one that just had pumpkins. They are double-sided, which is cool. So it has like this little flip here or little attachment that you're supposed to use to hang on the door. But I'll probably cut that off because I won't be using it. I'll probably be using it in some type of decor maybe in here i don't know but it was super cute and then they also had these cute little um these are actually pretty small too they're not very big but just a little um stand up sign that was only a dollar they have black or not black they have these trucks that she hauled a pretty good size that were for five bucks I went to two dollar journals and did not find them so I'm gonna keep looking and then I also found these these are bone pins and I just like to get little things like this especially during the holidays because I think they're perfect to add in friend mail I might jazz it up a little bit maybe add some bling you know how I am with that and then I was looking through like their toy sticker section and then I came across this puzzle set 
and this one reminded me of Dollar Trees as well but it had um, I just liked their style so this one is smaller it's a hundred pieces and this one is an 11 and a half by 8 so again be fun putting together framing it or um, putting it in front I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that but I was excited to see that and then I did pick up two Halloween stickers uh, I believe Dollar Tree has these as well, but I did pick these up from Dollar General. So if you don't find them at your DT, look for them there. And these are different. They're not from last year's because I grabbed all of the ones from last year. So I only picked up that set, and then I also picked up this one here, which is a new set as well. And they have, like, the little face masks, which is kind of cute. So, Yeah. That is it for my haul, guys. I went to three DTs last week, and I literally walked out with just the t-shirts and the puzzles. Yeah, nothing new. They haven't fully stocked up on all their like fall and Halloween stuff. I'm looking more forward to their fall decors. There's a couple things I'm looking for, but other than that, um, that's it. So it's kind of depressing. So, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys all in my next one. Bye, guys.